The first purpose is the transistor is used to amplify electric signals. It's a three-pronged device, and so what you have is kind of the input to the transistor that takes small signals in, and then you have the output of the transistor, which can be used as an amplifier to make a larger version of the input signals. That's what amplification is. It's taking the input signals, making an exact replica of the shape of it, but making the amplitude higher. And what that does is that effectively amplifies the signal. So for instance, if you have a microphone and you speak into the microphone, the raw signal coming out of the microphone would be a very small voltage, probably in the millivolt range. But that's not a high enough voltage to actually drive a speaker, and it certainly isn't a high enough power output or voltage output to drive an antenna to broadcast your voice across the air. So what we do is we use transistors to make a copy of the signal that is larger in amplitude. So we have a small signal in, and you can think of that small signal in as sort of controlling the output side of the circuit. It's almost like a valve that can be used to change the output current and voltage in direct lockstep with what the input is doing. So we can make an output signal exactly the same shape, but larger as the input signal. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.